Thoughts on this afternoon, Alex? It's very rare we talk about it after a defeat. Yeah, draws and authority was over three points. Um, I think it looked like we hadn't played for two weeks, to be honest with you. Um, we'd had two cancel fix, well, one cancel fix for one three week. Um, they were sharper than us, um, better off the ball than us, um, and full credit to them, they deserved it completely. Um, I think we looked a little bit leggy. Um, we obviously got, got in, get some players back from injury, which is good, but um, the overall sharpness of the team um, wasn't there, and I think it's clear that um, we're going to have to have a friendly um, in the gap that we've got before we play against Stockport. Um, I think the, the 11 for them uh, causes a lot of problems in behind. Um, we kind of mitigated them playing our two up top against against them to stop them playing out from the back um, first half, but we had to change it due to how narrow their front three were. Um, and yeah, just just I think overall we did miss chances. Um, we had chances with Morgan in the first half, um, a couple of good chances. Um, their number 12, the lad who come on at right back, made an unbelievable tackle to stop Morgan scoring yeah. in the second half. But we could have been 3-4 up, I think, in the first half, early doors, which would have put us out of sight. But when you when you don't take your chances, you get pegged back. And I, I truly believe that Drawsden deserved deserve the three points today. We also found a, a goalkeeper in sparkling form. For, I mean, some of the saves he pulled off first half were just yeah. absolutely tremendous. But we were saying that's probably the best side that we've played here this season. Yeah, I went to watch these against uh, Abbey Hall when they lost 3-1. Um, and they've got a different keeper in that that day. Um, and he cost them two goals, actually. Um, and the, the lad who's come in today played very well for them, I thought that. But yeah, they were, they were a good side. Um, you can see why they were on the run that they've been on. Um, good going forwards. Shame they're missing the, the lad on the left who's scored a lot of goals for them. Um, wish him well, obviously. Um, but yeah, they're a good side. Let's say got a few faces back. Red yep. starting, and yep. looked very sharp. Um, Jake also looked good when he came. Yeah, he was he was on for quite some time. Having yeah. to come on early for for Ben mm -hmm. and getting Connor back. At, at least we don't want another gap. But again, it's it's another little bit of time to get you know something in those guys' legs so they're they're sharp for the remainder of the season. Yeah, I thought uh, Red was excellent. Um, he really was. Um, Scored a great goal, didn't he? First, there was no stopping that shot. No, was no. Link some play, great, uh, great, great linking in the play with well with Morgan as he always does. And yeah, it's great to have Jake and Connor back, um, back playing. And and it's just a shame about Ben's injury because in an ideal world, Jake would probably could have been flat out for 30 minutes, but actually having to play 60, 70 minutes, obviously not as easy for him. But yeah, the gap will um, we'll have something in range for next week. Just make sure that we keep ticking over and taking into Stockport in a couple of weeks. Anything with Ben? Was that a, a, a groin? Just said, he, just said he felt it go tight and he was fine running in straight lines but the twisting and the turning was difficult for him. So position he's in. Just to do that, yeah. So again, a week off as you say, then just the visit to Stockport Town to, mm -hmm. to look forward to. Um, we probably all done one for the defeat before Christmas but it's just important at the top of the table for us to get get back on the horse and get winning again. Yeah, it's, it's a shame we've got that two week gap really because when you lose you want to put it right, don't you? Yeah. Um, we take each game the same every time that anybody comes here. We knew we were in for a tough game today, we know we'll be in for a tough game when Stockport come here in a couple of, week, in a couple of weeks time. So yeah, we'll prepare right, just make sure we're ready to go and, and, and do our best to get the result on the day. Cheers, Al. Cheers. Thanks, man.